you wanna build a $50,000 per month profit coaching business, you're going to wanna watch this video all the way through. Because in this video, I'm gonna give you the full social funnel blueprint that allowed me to go from zero, no coaching business in existence, to $97,000 collected in a single month within 16 weeks of starting my coaching business and now implementing the same exact social funnel, I've been able to consistently do over $100,000 a month every single month in 2024. So make sure to watch this video all the way through because you're gonna get a full step-by-step -step breakdown of what is the social funnel, how does it work, and how can you implement it in your own coaching business so that you can get between 30,000 and 50,000 a month in profit, and then eventually scale up to $100,000 a month. The reason I love the social funnel so much is because it is the most predictable way to sign two to four clients a week. Now, I love signing up clients, but what I love even more is knowing exactly how many clients I'll be able to sign up every single week consistently so that I actually have a sense of predictability inside of my coaching business. What I also don't like is super complicated funnels. I've tried running like a VSL funnel where you collect people's emails and phone numbers and then you have phone setters calling and texting those leads and then you book them in for a call and the leads are pretty cold and they get on the sales calls and they don't even know who you are or what you offer. So the social funnel is in 2024 the most simple and efficient funnel for you to just get your coaching business to 50,000 a month in profit because that's sort of where life gets good. 50,000 a month in profit is where you go to the grocery store, you eat out at restaurants and you don't think about the price. You can travel when you want, you can work where you want. And so that's my goal is to get you using this social funnel to 50,000 a month in profit in your coaching business and then eventually scale you up to 100,000 a month. Now, the last thing I'll say before I jump right in is you've probably scrolled through Instagram in the last, I don't know, six months to a year and seen that every single coach looks the exact same. Whether you're a business coach, a fitness coach, a relationship coach, every single coach looks and sounds the exact same. And so what I love about the social funnel is it allows you to build your audience and your followers consistently so that you can have a sense of authority in your niche and so people view you as the expert. Before implementing the social funnel, I never had people get on the phone and thank me for joining my coaching program. And so that's what the social funnel can allow you to do is actually build authority in your niche so that people actually trust you and want to learn from you. So why the heck should you listen to me? And why is the social funnel the most bulletproof funnel to get your coaching business to $50,000 per month. Well, I started a marketing agency two years ago. In my marketing agency, I ended up scaling it to $50,000 a month using the social funnel. But what's more important than that is that my clients in my agency were all online coaches. In fact, they were some of the biggest online coaches in the coaching space. And what my clients paid me to do was help them get more clients by running paid ads and creating content for them. And so by running an agency for coaches, I learned a lot about how the biggest coaches in the space were acquiring clients consistently. And so then when I went to start my own coaching offer, I was able to do over 20K month one of starting my coaching business. And by month four, I'd done 97,000 in cash in a single month. And now using that same social funnel that I learned back when I was running my agency, and after helping hundreds of other coaches now inside of my coaching business, I have 100% confidence that the social funnel is the only funnel in 2024 to scale your coaching business to $50,000 per month in profit. I've tried every single funnel and there's a lot of shiny objects in the coaching industry right now of, oh, try this funnel or try that funnel. What I love about the social funnel is that it operates based off of principles, not just the tactics of what's working right now in the shiny object space on the internet. The social funnel operates off of timeless principles that will always work if you implement them properly, which hopefully you'll be able to do after you watch this video. The key here is that the social funnel hasn't just worked for me. In fact, it's worked for a lot of other people as well. Take my client Peter, for example, who started a coaching offer from absolute scratch after running his own marketing agency, and his coaching business was helping tax advisors scale their tax firm. And within six months of implementing the social funnel, he hit his first $70,000 a month with a brand new coaching offer. Or take Johnny, who started a brand new coaching offer, coaching life insurance agents, and within four months of starting his coaching offer, he hit $88,000 per month inside of his coaching business. Or take my client, Tim Danilov, for example, who took his own coaching business from zero to $30,000 per month within three months of implementing the social funnel. Now I could keep going, but 
I wanna tell you how the social funnel actually works so that you can go implement it in your own coaching business. Now, if you do want my own personal help scaling your coaching business to 50,000 a month in profit, you can always DM me the word coach on Instagram and I'm pretty responsive over there and we can chat and see if it might be a good fit for us to work together. So how does the social funnel actually work? There's three key phases to any funnel. There's the top of the funnel, the middle of the funnel, and the bottom of the funnel. Let's start with the top of the funnel. Don't get me wrong, organic content can be great. And you can sign up some clients doing organic content. You can also sign up clients sending cold DMs. You could also sign up clients going on LinkedIn and creating a profile and reaching out to people. But me personally, I much prefer not to just sign up clients, but to know exactly how many clients I can sign up every single week consistently. Now for me, inside of my coaching business, we typically sign up between four and seven new clients every single week at the moment. But for you, my goal is that you can leave this video and at least be able to go sign up two to four clients per week consistently. Reason being at the top of our funnel, we're gonna implement paid ads. The reason we're going to do paid ads is not just to take our hard earned dollars and throw them down the drain. The reason we're gonna implement paid ads is because it's the most predictable way to generate new attention. I get hundreds of thousands of people seeing my face and I get to impress upon and influence hundreds of thousands of people every single month because I run paid ads. There is no other way to consistently generate that much attention unless you're just amazing at going viral. And even if you were amazing at going viral, I would still recommend that you dial in a paid acquisition system so that you know you always have predictability and consistency inside of your coaching business. Now, inside of the social funnel, we use Instagram paid ads to generate attention and conversations. So we run profile visit ads to constantly generate new followers so we can build our authority and build more trust with our audience and grow our following. And we run DM ads to generate conversations with new prospects consistently. Now the key here is not just to run ads to anybody and everybody. The key here is to have hyper-targeted ads that specifically speak to your exact ideal client. That way, every single dollar you spend on ads, you don't just get two or three dollars back, but instead you get 10, 15, or 20 dollars back depending on the next step in the middle of the funnel. Now, there's other pieces at the top of the funnel you could implement like Instagram organic or YouTube organic, and those are amazing. But I would always recommend that you have paid ads so you have consistency inside your coaching business. Now, once we generate this attention at the top of the funnel, the next step is getting people into the middle of our funnel. And this is really where the magic happens. This is where most people fail and fall off. This is why most people only have a two to three X return on their ad spend and not a 10 or 15 X on their ad spend. The reason being that generating attention with ads is a one-time thing. You set them up and now you're gonna consistently get attention. But what you do with that attention is honestly more important than just getting the attention. So now that we're consistently getting our face in front of new eyeballs every day, it's our job to nurture those people so that they actually want to book in a call and buy our programs. Now there's a few key mechanisms that we use in the middle of the funnel in order to do this. The first mechanism is actually just using Instagram itself. Instagram has so many built-in features to help you nurture your followers and nurture people that have engaged with your Instagram profile. The first core thing is actual Instagram posts and Instagram reels. That way you can get your face in front of your audience every single day organically without spending any more money on paid ads. A second key way is Instagram stories and these are honestly so underutilized. On your Instagram story, you can do a daily call to action telling people to book in a call with you and since stories go away after 24 hours, it doesn't seem salesy or spammy. Now on your story, you can also share who you are in your personal life. There's two key parts that go into stories, personal and promotion. Most people do promotion, not a lot of people do personal. I remember a couple of my clients coming back to me and I asked them, hey, why did you buy from me specifically? There's a lot of coaches out there. And what they said was two things. One of them said, Grayson, it's because you got married at a young age and I also got married at a young age. And the second reason was because I traveled a lot and they also wanted to travel a lot while running their coaching business. And so instead of going and buying from other coaches, because I posted that stuff and they got to know who I was as a coach, because people don't buy coaching, they buy coaches, they were actually nurtured enough 
to buy from me. The third key way to nurture people on the Instagram platform is using Instagram retargeting ads. So whenever someone follows or engages with your profile, you can now retarget those people with more direct offers and ads. What that typically looks like is an ad towards a lead magnet, like the one you're watching right now, where you can collect someone's email in exchange for sending them a resource or an asset. And second, you can run retargeting ads that just make a direct offer for someone to book in a call with you. Now this leads me to my next middle of funnel asset, which is email. There is no other way for you to have your name pop up on somebody's phone every single morning, except for email. By me generating conversations and collecting people's emails by sending them a lead magnet, I can literally be in their inbox and on the front of their cell phone every single day where my name pops up. Grayson Lupus, and I'm hoping your name is gonna pop up on other people's phones soon because you're gonna implement the social funnel in your own coaching business. Now, the last key middle of funnel asset is YouTube. There's not a certain amount of days or weeks required for someone to go from they have no idea who you are to they're buying your coaching program. What is required is an amount of content consumed. If all you're doing is posting on Instagram, that's great. People can scroll through your reels, watch your stories every single day, and I'm sure you'll sign up some clients. But if you can post long form content on YouTube, generate attention on Instagram, run paid ads on Instagram to get people's attention and more eyeballs, and then direct that attention to your long form content on YouTube, you'll be able to nurture people so much quicker because they can binge all of your YouTube content, watch hours of your face and you talking, and all of a sudden they trust you so much more now and they're willing to book in a call. So that leads me to the bottom of the funnel where even more magic happens. This is where we have commission only appointment setters go inside of your Instagram DMs and reach out to new followers doing warm outbound and handle inbound DMs from the DM ads that we're running. So your appointment setter will do warm outbound and inbound messaging. Now, if you set up the rest of the funnel properly, this part should honestly be pretty simple. There's a very simple script that you can walk prospects through to get them to book in a call with you at the end of that conversation. And by doing this, you should be able to book in two to four calls a day consistently. Whereas in my coaching business, I booked upwards of 15 to 17 calls a day using this exact social funnel. And if you're able to book two to four actually qualified people that have money calls a day on your calendar consistently, you should be able to at minimum close two to four clients per week. So that is a full breakdown of how the social funnel works, what it is, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you're a coach and you want my own personal help getting to $50,000 a month inside of your own coaching business, I would love to help you out. All you have to do is go to my Instagram and DM me really anything, but DM me the word coach. And that's how I know to reach out to you and potentially you and I can chat and see if it might be a good fit for us to work together. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.